Lord, we say thank you. We glorify you, Jehovah. And you see, for everyone who is watching this program on the HW, Lord, I speak a blessing upon them, Lord. I say thank you. Even the way that I'm going to speak, Lord, my Redeemer intervene in them, Lord. I say thank you in just name of prayer. Amen. Um, hi, people. My name is Amamba Patrick. I'm also known as Mr. PC. I'm happy for the viewers. I'm happy for everyone. If you need any help, comment. If you... you you can you, you cannot manage to comment you can just leave your number on the comment then we can call you whenever we find uh, your number and today uh, i want to just to talk about uh, sonship or children sonship or children if you say sonship we say uh, son, uh, sonship is a state of being a child is a state of being a son so uh, if you are a child of God, meaning you are going to obtain things from God, uh, the things of God are for His children. If you have got, uh, you have got sonship, meaning God will give you what you need. The Bible tells me that uh, those who believe, we are given the power to be called the children of God, to be called the sons of God. So if you don't have the sonship, then you aren't a child of God. If you don't have the sonship, forget about the power. The power that you do watch manifesting from different men of God, they, are, they have got that power because they are children of God. Even Elisha for him to go the double portion because he humbled himself and became the spiritual son of Elijah. So my, my, my friend, wherever you are, you have to have the sonship, even the inheritance. If somebody dies today, for example, example, a rich man of God, which you can think about, they die today. They will leave those inheritance, they will leave those properties to their children. So if you're not a child, if if you're not a child of God, you have to be a child of God. If your physical, your biological parent, they died, the Bible tells me that Jesus told them that I am the father to the fatherless. So you have to involve Jesus in all your doings. The Bible tells me that uh, there was a father who had two, two, two children. The, other, the, younger child, the younger son took the money and went to a far country. When the money finished, he returned home. We call him a lost son. To me, according to the revelation which I'm perceiving from the Lord at the moment, he was not a lost son. He just lost a, the ownership. Why am I saying so? Because he located the house. He, he went to the house back and the father embraced him. How can somebody who has lost locate the, child, uh, the, the house? So that person lost just uh, the sonship. So wherever you are, you have to be the child of God. If you believe, God will give you the power to be called his, uh, his son, to be called his child. So a child... You know, a child will obtain everything from God. The Bible says that uh, the kingdom of God is for little children. So if you cannot be a child, forget about the, uh, the kingdom of God. Wherever you are, uh, if you want to receive Jesus, repeat after me. Wherever you are, just say, Lord Jesus, I receive you. And I believe that you are God. You alone are God. I receive you from today. Use me mightly. Use me like ever before. Deliver me from the power of pornography. Deliver me from any power which does not confess your name. I say thank you for everything. God bless you.